Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to High Media Help Desk. I am your host and I am going to show you how to make a main method using short codes in IntelliJ Java. So what was all the words that I just said? I'm going to break it down real quick. I am going to show you a short code. A short code short codes for a main method in IntelliJ code in the Java language. So let's take it bit by bit. IntelliJ is the compiler that you use. The application itself is IntelliJ. And Java is the language coding language you're going to be using. The method, the main method, is where you type the code that you want to run. So it's where you're going to type things to do things down here at the build or terminal or so on and so forth. So basically the things you want the th the the program to do will will be ran in that main method. And a short code is what is basically a the ability to write a couple small things without having to type an obscene amount of words and letters because I'm going to show you that you can type four characters and then the result of that is a lot of other characters that you would have spent a lot of time typing out or mem or most likely googling what the exact structure is. So after you've made your main Java file in your project, which I'm just going to presume you're at this point, you press P s v m and if you look here at the little drop down bar you see main method declaration so we're going to hit enter and voila you have your main method so each of these mean a couple different things but once we get to methods i will go into those in more detail all you need to know right now is that everything you put inside here will run we'll go Hold tight, we'll go over public, static, void, all, and I will tell you what all these words mean further down the line. Now, while we're at it, let's also do another short code. And let's make a simple hello world program. To So to output hello world, we need to make a system.out.println statement. And so system means it's outputting to a console or what, to whatever console the program is being running in. Out means to put out and print means, so let me take this line by line. System, the print is what you're doing. The out is printing it out, and the system is the console. This is my understanding of it. I might be a little bit wrong, but for all intents and purposes, that's what it is. Now, print ln stands for print new line. So, I'll show you what happens when you just do system dot out print. Let's type something in here. Let's do hello. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to print, copy that, and paste it. The way I did that was is I selected it, I pressed Control C, and then I made, went down one and it went down a new line and said and t clicked Control V. That is the that is how you can use your if you're on um, Mac it would be the command button, and that's just how you can copy and paste with ease without having to right click and do all that mess. So I'm gonna replace hello with world. So let's run this code. I'm gonna go up here to run. It automatically, I have it set to automatically save and start build, parsing, finishing. Okay, that looks not great. So what if I wanted to add a new line? Well, 
I want it to go down one. So what I want it to do is I want it to be hello, enter, world. That is where the new line comes in. So ln. Print ln when I go to run this. There is the result. So let's do a brief recap of everything I've explained here. I, have, I showed you how to... Hmm. I almost forgot. Let me do something else. Here's another short code before we get started. S O U T stands for system dot out and it is a short code to make that statement. So I'm going to show you guys that one more time, or you can rewind the video, but I'm going to show you regardless, because I'm pretending people are watching this as I'm doing it. S-O-U-T stands for system out, and it is the short code you use to make that appear on your screen. And then we're just going to type world, and voila. So... Let me just recap everything I've recovered in this video real quick. I showed you guys how using the PSVM shortcode makes your main method, which what the main method does is it it is the can it is what you type into to make the things you want to happen. Because if you go down here and say copy that and paste it there watch what happens doesn't work that so it has to be in the main method lastly i showed you the difference between system.out.print and system.out.println which stands for print line and I showed you the short code to make a system.out.println statement. So th thank you guys so much for watching, and we will see you guys in the next episode.